Dude, that is, that is scary seeing it enter the room like that. This is intense. This is intense. What? The Wait. Big thanks to Dropped Out of the Camp for sponsoring this video. If you're going to get 10% off the game, you can use my code, link in the description. Thank you very much. I am a huge fan of zombie games, specifically Call of Duty Zombies. I used to play the Zombies game every single day for the majority of my childhood. I've made COD Zombies Bone Lab mods. I even worked for Mr. Zombies himself, Noah J456. Zombies is my game, and recently I was contacted by the people behind Drop Dead The Cabin, a very COD Zombies-esque VR game for a sponsored video. How could I say no? They've recently launched their newest update, 115, which adds something very special to the game. Using the power of the Quest 3's color pass-through, you're able to play this game in your own home. Mixed reality zombies. Now when they told me about this, I had to test this out. But as I've said in previous videos, I'm not too comfortable with the idea of thousands of people looking around my house. So I came up with a solution. Instead of the game bringing the cabin to me, I traveled hundreds of miles to bring the cabin to the game. Sticking to the theme I've been doing recently of trying completely new formats of videos, I tried to do a little vlog section here. There wasn't too much to show during the train ride, but once we got to the nearest town, we found this cool castle thingy. Dude, it's, it's Der Eisendrak. I can see Dempsey, he's right there. Oh my God. Then after a quick bus ride, we made our way towards the cabin. We're gonna get ax murdered. It's gonna be one of us that's the ax murderer. That's not true. Maybe don't look behind you then. I'm so scared right now. Don't put that in the video. Oh my god, berries. Oh my god. Dinner. No. Oh. This is a sign that says passing place. Oh. The soil is freshly dug. Someone passed her. <laughs> Whoa. As well as vlogging, this is my first time traveling for a video. The directions we were given were kind of vague, but it's not like we were going to get lost or anything. Okay, update. I think I'm a little bit close to the, to the cabin we're supposed to be staying at. Well, I say we, but I'm pretty sure Hanaki found like a pack of raccoons and kind of became part of their family. I'm not sure what they're doing, but but I'm going to try and find this this uh, this cabin. This looks like some found footage type bullshit, bro. What the fuck is this, man? Oh, bro. That's a deer. Do you see that? God damn. I really do be in the sticks though. <laughs> oh, dude, there it is. Oh my God, it's the cabin. I've been out here so long. I want to keep my voice down in case there's any creatures that want to kill me. But uh, yeah, all right, well, let's just fucking. So here we are in Drop Dead the Cabin. No internet, of course, because we are in like a cabin in the woods. Did I still can't get over how crisp the, the Quest 3 displays are? It's wild. So to start doing this mixed reality stuff, we're going to go to Home Invasion and then Start Game. And then we're going to see this little menu pop up. And this is because before you can start playing mixed reality stuff, you need to map out the room that you're in. So this is the cabin, nice and cozy. We're going to start scan and... <laughs> I re I don't know what it is about this process, but I really like doing this. Just gotta get all the walls, all the ceiling, and it says we're good to go, but I like to be a perfectionist about it. I feel like it'll really help my immersion, even though I, I don't think it makes that much of a difference. <laughs> all the way down the side of the cat. Okay, I don't think you need to do this. All the ceiling. Look at how the tiles just fall into place. All right, okay, I think now we're good to go. <laughs> Oh, uh, yep, okay. It's put the walls down perfectly, so no need to adjust that. So now with all that out of the way, it comes my favorite part. We need to add the furniture in the room. So what you want to do is you want to pick out some furniture in the room, aim down at the bottom corner, place a point, bring that point all the way up to the top, and then another point all the way across, and then all the way across again. And now we have, once we set it in the menu, our table. And you got to make sure you do this for like every big thing in the space. So we're going to get this couch real quick. Then we're going to get the countertop here. And then we got this little thing here. I think this is more of a shelf, to be honest. Got another shelf over here. Can't forget the hob and this rock in the corner. So after you've outlined all your furniture, you're going to need to outline the windows and doors. Very important. If you don't do this, the zombies don't have anywhere to break into and the game basically doesn't work. So essential, we get all the windows and the doors. Very important. And you can also do wall art if you want. And with that, the space is 100% done, so we're just gonna hit complete. And it looks locked, but if we hit play MR, um, there we go. It, it's, it, it works. Got a revolver here, got some ammo. We're gonna activate the beacon. You can just shoot this button. There we go. Boom, first try. Okay, here's our first zombie. He's, uh, oh, okay, never mind. Here's our first zombie. We're just gonna, boop, 
So the main goal here is to have this transmitter up for 10 minutes. Once that's over, we can escape and beat the game. But while that's happening, we have these zombies here that are going to try and kill us and also take the transmitter down. Oh no, is he going to- Oh my god! <laughs> All right, okay. Dude, that is that is scary seeing it enter the room like that. I don't know if we can board these winners back up. Uh, if you can, I don't know how. So once the boards are gone here, they are gone. Yo. Yo. Ooh, we got an Uzi. Oh, I like that. I like that. Oh my god, what, what is that? They have actual forest creatures invading the cabin right now. What is this? Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, what? These things are so... <laughs> this is intense. This is intense. Also, can I just say, this is like my first MR experience, really. This is so cool. Actually being in the space, like walking around. I actually really like this. Oh, oh okay. They took the beacon down. It's fine. We can reset it the same way we started it, just by here. And we just gotta keep these motherfuckers away from the beacon, and we should be fine. Boop. <gasps> Wait, another upgrade. Oh, the 1911. And a little baseball bat. That's pretty neat. Dude, what am I what am I hearing right now? What the Wait. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I think put a massive hole in the wall. Wait. No, that's not fair. You can't take my one safe wall away from me. Dude, I can't have my back to anything now. <laughs> I'm getting attacked on all sides. Okay, there's like four more minutes. This should be f Jesus Christ, okay. Oh no, I don't have any ammo left. This is fine. I have an axe. Oh my god. Please, please die. Please die. Thank you very much. Okay, we do have a little bit of ammo. Uh, oh, give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me this. Oh my god, SDG. Let's fucking go. Holy shit. Oh, oh. Okay, there's little birds now. What is that? Dude, this SDG feels so cool. I need to push this button though. Gotta get the beacon back on. Okay, okay. Jesus Christ. Let me fucking, let me reset my beacon. Hey, your beacon stopped transmitting. Yes, I know, I know. Boom, boom. There we go. Okay. Oh my god. Dude, this is so stressful. Resources deployed. <gasps> Oh my god, it's the Olympia. They 100% chose these weapons on purpose, bro. This is like classic COD zombie stuff right here. 1911 STG Olympia. Come on now. Okay. Okay, I like this shotgun. Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. Literally 30 seconds. Okay. I gotta play this safe. As much as I like the shotgun, I don't think it's as versatile as the uh, as the STG. So we're just gonna... <laughs> yep. Okay, that's it. Time is up. And... <laughs> Oh my god, dude just bursts through the ceiling, that is- Oh, Okay, okay, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out of here. Oh my god, that- That was crazy. Dude, I actually like- I need a minute. I need to, <laughs> I need to sit down on the couch. I don't play many MR experiences, but I'm gonna need to like, create a space to do more of this stuff because, wow.